Good morning, Johns Creek. Today is Thursday, March 23rd. On today's show, we got announcements lined up as well as some segments to throw your way. I'm Liza McPherson. And I'm Jeremy Rose, and JCNN starts now. Today's opener is really a haiku. Time for announcements. Attention juniors, are you interested in work-based learning next year? This is a class that lets you volunteer to be an office aide or work off campus in a paying or non-paying job. Applications will close next week on March 30th and no further students will be considered for next year. If you have any questions or wish to apply, see Dr. Swigert in room 166 or email him at swigert at fultonschools.org. Prom this year will be held on Saturday, April 15th from 7 to 11 p.m. at the Buckhead Theater. Tickets are on sale on GoFan for $90. On March 27th, ticket prices will go up to $115. If you are bringing a guest from another school, please stop by the front office and pick up a prom guest form, which will, be needed to which will need to be completed in order to purchase a ticket for your guest. Ticket sales end on April 12th. Come to the annual International Night tomorrow for a night filled with cultural games, food, performances, and fun from all over the world. Hurry and get your tickets by scanning the QR codes on the flyers located around the school. Pre-sale tickets are $8, and at the door they will be $11. Hope to see you there. And now, we shall witness Johnny Creek's return to the hallways of JCHS to root and toot once more. <laughs> get away from me. Get away from me with that magic box. Yeehaw! <laughs> oh my god, it's Miss Coleman. Howdy. <laughs> uh, how are you doing today? I'm pretty good. I'm pretty good. Uh, whoa, whoa! What is this? What? What is this? What is this box? How, how does this work? What kind of sorcery is this? Howdy, Mr. Albert. Hi. I'm, I'm Johnny Creek. No. Have you seen my horse? No. Okay. Oh, partner, who are you? Howdy, partner. I'm Mayor Smith. Have you seen my horse? Uh, uh it went down by right there. Over oh. there. Thank you so much, Emmanuel. He, he lied. Where's my horse? <laughs> Howdy. <laughs> how are you? How are you gonna practice Creed today? How are you practicing Creed? You know, just helping the kids, helping the kids. All right, we always love that. Thank you. All I wanted was to educate the children on Creed. We'll try, we'll try harder. I'll see you next week. I'm John at Creek, sign, signing off from JCNN. Have you seen my horse? If you are interested in being one of our featured speakers at graduation, submit a draft of a speech that lasts three to five minutes to Mr. Schultz by Monday, April 10th. A committee will select finalists to give their speeches to the committee in late April, where the speakers will be selected. Interested seniors must email their draft to Mr. Schultz at schultzby at fultonschools.org by April 10th. There will be an honor roll celebration event giving out treats next Wednesday, March 29th in the courtyard during all three lunch periods. Please check your school email for an invitation. And now, let's take a look at how Johns Creek is preparing for an exciting event tomorrow night. Hi guys, I'm Rhea Toxie. I'm the president of the Indian Culture Exchange at Johns Creek High School. Indian Culture Exchange is an Indian club at Johns Creek that promotes the Indian community by doing festivals like Diwali and Holi. And we also host the International Night at Johns Creek High School. The amount of practice and preparation we take into this event is about six hours a week, I'd say. On top of having an ice dance, which is like seven minutes long, 55 people, we also have to coordinate all of the cultural tables that go into the night when you're eating your food, as well as all the performers that are performing on the night itself. 
My absolute favorite part of the night is at the very end where everyone is clapping for all the performers and it's just super good to see all the smiling faces on the audience. My name is Rashida and I'm the Vice President of ICE and my job is to work with Ria and the other officers to host cultural events for students that are part of ICE as well as prepare for International Night and run the whole event. International Night is a very important event because it allows students to talk about their cultures and showcase their talents as well. Um, it allows them to get back in touch with their roots and allows other students to learn about various cultures and countries and what they do. My favorite part of the night is actually being on stage and performing. I love hearing the audience cheer and like scream and feel the excitement of being on stage with my friends and just dancing and having a lot of fun. My name is Katie Chong and I'm president of the Korean Club. My name is Irene Ha. I'm also a member of the Korean Club and participating in the Girls International Night drum team. <laughs> Our girls team has been meeting multiple times for a couple months um, each week and we've been doing multiple hours every time we meet so it's been a lot of work. I think doing the Korean drums was a really good release of energy for everyone and a fun way for us to come together and share our Korean culture and especially encourage people to continue doing things like this for the following years. Hi, my name is Tiffany Abasahan. I'm a current junior and I'm going to be the president of National French Honor Society next year. We've been meeting up with French students in Medlock Bridge Elementary School to mentor them on a song we've been wanting to learn. It's called On Ecle Sous Les Mous and that means we write on the walls and it's just a really interesting and deep song about why we sing and why we do French and why we do the things we do. That's just some of the many clubs working hard to make an international night a perfect experience. Make sure to show your support Friday, March 24th at 5.30 p.m. Well, that is all the announcements and segments that we have for you today, Johns Creek. Have a great day. Thank you, man. And as always, don't forget, don't forget to, to stay, stay classy. classy.